Welcome back guys. So the last we played, we managed to rescue Soma's uh, three advisors. We lit uh, this beacon. Now where is it? Da, 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 da. Up here. And we rescued them and they managed to find themselves back at camp. Um, whoever had splintered away from the group had came back. So now we're at the eve of uh, fighting back and gaining Grand Bridge. By doing that, we can secure the alliance. But first, let's get to know uh, Soma's advisors a little better. Leaf, Soma says you're the man who built her longships. That's right. Each has a sharp keel, a stout mast, and a poem etched into the hull to sing the praises of the Dringer who commands her. A longship is heavy with fate. Just a few lengths of wood between you and a watery grave. What better place to put a line of poetry, hmm? Agreed. It's good to fight beside you, Leif. Likewise, Eivor. Thanks again for plucking me and my warriors from the mire. Garland, is that right? That's right. You are Eivor, the infinite fighter, or forever warrior. It's a glorious name. Many thanks. You were in a tight spot when we found you. Indeed. The Saxons pursued me, ran me bloody through the swamps and into the lap of bandits. And the wolves came. We all have our one day. The day we die. How you greet that day is all that matters. I'm proud to say that I was ready. Well, it's good to see you breathing still. You're of Vienna. And you are Eivor's sunbeam. You cut through the fog like the sun burns through ice. You're in high spirits, all things considered. The ambush, losing your home. In this moment, yes. But ah, you feel that? The moment has passed. We are free to pursue the next. What a gift! It's good to have you in this fight, Vienna. I like you, Eivor. You may help me here or step on me. And by the look of you, I'd welcome either. All that's left. I thought we'd be safe in the fog, but Wigman's men hunted us, pierced my boy through his heart. He hadn't seen his sixteenth summer. Ah, we'll make him pay the blood debt, him and all his Saxon allies. <laughs> The day is new, and the air is bracing. Are you ready for the fight ahead? Let's take your city back. That's what I like to hear. Meet me at the western gate of Grantbridge. We've assembled there. Have care you do not enjoy taking orders from anyone but your Jarl back home. I fight for Sigurd, none else. While you're on this ship, Dag, you fight for me, and for Soma's loyalty. We fight for her. I know a crazed man about my age called Roker. We are taken to calling Roker the Roden for his habit of collecting axes. We can continue there, later. A military encampment. I know a crazed man about my age called Roker. We are taken to calling Roker the Roden. Twenty years he collected axes of all make and size. He had never seen a day of battle, but he swore to Thor that he would. 
In his 31st year, after drinking too much ale, Rocker seduced another man's wife. That man called a Holmgang against Rocker. Rocker accepted the Holmgang, and on the agreed upon day, he laid out 12 of his axes and asked, Which of these will I use to slay you? Will it be Bone Splitter? He said. My bearded blade inscribed with Sather runes, affixed to a handle of English oak? Or Blood Fountain, he continued. My Danax, which swings through the air on two hands with the speed of an arrow's flight. Or might it be Twin Wolf Wounder? Broker growled, growing even more bold. A fierce pair of throwing axes. At that moment, the man who had challenged Roker brought a large stone down upon his head. Roker died instantly, and his axes were given away as gifts. <laughs> <laughs> There's a fun story. side of the door. Move when you get a signal and not a moment before. Wakeman must know we're here. As he should. They shouldn't let you cut your cutscene like that, man. They should let you hear the dialogue. Very annoying. It's probably something that they could change in future games. Wakeman! Honor thief! I know you're up there. Return Grand Bridge to me, Wigmund. No more of our people need die. We may talk this out, lord to lord. Ha <laughs> ha! What are we to talk about? You have nothing I need. Worth by birth, heathen. I was born a noble. You were plucked from a giant's armpit. I built this town. From a mud hut to a thriving port. And we both know you'll bleed those ridges dry without my guiding hand. Leave! Go die in the muck where you belong, heathens! Wigman! Wigman! Let's try one final time! Quit Grant Bridge! And when she is mine once more, I may spare your life! Ha! I command Grant Bridge! I am master here! And I will scour you rats from this land like rot from a festering wound. Let me give you some advice, old bear. The surest way to stop a wound from festering isn't with a blade. It's with fire. <laughs> no! Thanes of Brandenburgshire! Retain what is yours! <laughs> Since we breached the wall, regroup at the longhouse. We'll surely find him there. Oh, this 
Others have calmed here. Go on. I weather the loss of these boats. This uh, lore and Norse lore is actually really, really metal. If you do have a chance to read through it, hello. If it is strength you require, you need look no further. I'll be here should you call again. Kind of sus, huh? A little bit suspect that you're here waiting inside to be recruited, or we just killed a bunch of your friends. Hmm, nah. Probably not. Tricky. 
one of those tattoos. Huh. No sign of Wickman here. He may be hiding within the city walls. Shall we search? No. He'll be gone. Count on it. Argar coward. But we've struck a bold claim today. Walk with me. I want you to sound our battle horn to announce our victory. Let all the Shire know that Grandbridge is retaken. The sound of the horn means prosperity, long life, bounty. Why me? Why not? You were the keystone to this attack. You turned the tide. Let the wind from your lungs breathe life back into my city. My clan throws the best feasts, I think you'll find. You enjoy yourself? I did. But were you celebrating a morning? You looked unsure. The night of the attack, I heard sounds of bloodshed coming from the Longhouse. In moments, the city was overrun with Saxons, so I called a retreat. We all have our one day, but not like that. Not that day. I've heard this before. That the Saxons appeared as if from the shadows. In all my time in Grantbridge, this tunnel was my most careful project. The best kept secret in the city. Now a hundred or more Saxons know the smell of it. The only people who knew about this tunnel were me. And the three in my inner circle. Wigmund could have escaped in the chaos of the fight. The city was teeming with my men, posted at all gates. Wigmund was shown this tunnel and used it both to enter and escape. By whom? That is where I hesitate. Between Leif, Galen and Birna, I cannot say. But they are the three who helped me dig this in secret. I hoped you might lend me your wits. You are a fresh ally. I could use your eyes and ears. I promised you I'd help secure your city. That task isn't yet done, it seems. Good. I sent Galen, Leif, and Birna to destroy what remains of Wigman's power throughout the Shire. Meet with them. Raid with them. Get to know them as best as you can. Find out which of them betrayed me. I'll do what I can, but you know your warriors far better than I do. Between you and me, my heart is clouded. I love these three as if we shared a womb. I need clear, sound judgment. I need you, Eivor. You have me. Thank you. Feel free to take a look around as you wish. Search the city, the tunnel, and here, a gift, for retaking Grandbridge with us. One of the few things I have left from my blood family. Oh 
man, this is heavy. So we got a treat in our midst. That's something we'll be uncovering in the next video. So uh, guys, thank you so much for tuning in with me on this. And in the next video, we will find out who the traitor is. Alright, if you like what you see so far, please don't forget to subscribe, like, and leave a comment down below. If you'd like to see any kinds of uh, footage or coverage, do let me know. Till then, peace out.